Good morning. Welcome to the Cook Report. Today is March the 9th. That means it's Wednesday. So the topic is the mind. And today I wanted to be mindful about several things. Uh, thank you, Kelvin, for being co-host and reminding me to turn off phones and, and whatnot, all the things the co-host responsibilities. It's tremendous help he is, tremendous. And in the show today, we want to talk about one simple topic. In content management scheme of things, there are guest bloggers. Now, some people say guest blogging is going to go away. Nobody will do it. Well, you haven't seen basic blogging tips from Eileen Smith. It's full of guest blog posts, so I don't think it's going to go away. And being envious, I said, well, I'd like to have my own guest blogging policy requirements, if you will. So I come up with the award-winning HubSpot inbound marketing blog. HubSpot's rules were based on the fact they have 330,000 subscribers, over a million and a half visitors a month. And so they got to be pretty good at handling blogs and guest bloggers and exceptional guest bloggers and so forth and sharing it with the internet community. If they're getting a million and a half visitors a month, that's probably a pretty good indication they're doing it right. So with thanks to HubSpot for the rules, our company, my company, V Domain Hosting Inc. is looking for comprehensive action oriented how to style posts that will teach and entertain our readers in various aspects of our mission. And the mission, internet and network solution provider. We provide internet solutions we provide network solutions what those might have to be now welcome to the chat new visitors in the room and fr oh fraser just came in that reminds me now that it's shout out time um we're going to have the show notes available to you of course on the cookreport.podbean.com but i found out that i can do a hashtag the cook report and find it there as well so if you're interested in seeing how well it performs in your search, take a look there. We're going to have in the show notes, we'll have the monthly schedule and how to um, have categories filter those different monthly posts in the show notes as well. So on that note, we'll go to do shout outs. And we were joking with Frazier this morning. He's Edinburgh Dusters, you know, the company that likes to clean. And Fraser said, you know, it would really be good if you had a cook part of the cook report where you're going to make a meal and prepare a meal. And I thought, hey, wait a minute. He's got this wrong way around. It should be the new feature of Edinburgh Dusters is that they like to cook and they'll come back and clean after they're done. What be You know, it's a total bundle package because that's the two parts of the recipe, right? And on a recipe such, such as that, give Edinburgh Dusters a call. They're in Edinburgh, Scotland. They're the company that likes to clean. And in fact, they're probably cleaning right now as we speak. Also in Scotland, Kevin Scullion's got a site, passingplaces.scot, makes perfect sense. You get off the plane in Edinburgh and your mobile phone is gonna say, oh, are you looking for a place to do a tour, have information about travel, Kevin Scullion is the guy. He's number one. I think that's what number one designation was get provided by uh, Kelvin the other day when we were doing the show. Big thanks to Blab.im. Uh, congratulations on their continued polish and refine the Blab software. That is the application we use to record this podcast because when we're done, when we close this session, if you will, They'll email us a copy of the, the Blab audio and the video so we can upload it onto iTunes. On the subject of iTunes, big thank you to iTunes for giving us the space that we can upload that into. And if that MP4 is what you're listening to right now, I invite you to subscribe somewhere down there in, in the bottom. There's a subscription area that you can subscribe to the channel and join the other people that are listening and, and looking at the show every day, Monday through Friday, 7 a.m. All the topics of conversation that we cover are in there. So thank you to Stitcher Radio. Thank you to the Blab profile that we have that has the content. 
thecookreport.podbean.com has the content. And it's also, like I said, it's available on YouTube. It's virtue of being in podbean.com. It's on iTunes as well. So you can search for The Cook Report on iTunes and listen to us there. The Blab profile that we have that gives us the show notes, we also publish onto a WordPress blog, which is guyrcookonlineservices.com, whack blog. What a mouthful. And that gives you all of that stuff. All those locations that have the show notes will have a short link to say, click here to go to the show notes. It'll take you to that blog. And that blog also is going to have the evaluation question. Now, I could tell you what the question is, but that kind of ruins things. It's a yes, no question. Have a look at it. Please give us a response if you're listening. And we enjoyed your feedback on that. And now at the end of the show, like I always do, so that we can know that it's really a done. Did I forget anything, Calvin? I don't think so. Um, did you mention Podbean? Oh, that's right. The The show notes are going to be listed on the cookreport.podbean.com. Be sure and take a look at that. On that note, I'm going to say those three magic words. It's a wrap.